Bitcoin against US dollar this week has been bouncing between two, these two price levels. We can see after the price has made a bullish breakout the previous week, the price has continued to fall down, making a confirmation of this breakout. We can see that the price has returned back down, did not close back inside, and then the price is bouncing between these price levels. On a Thursday, the price has made a breakout. We can see the price has uh, close the day above this one and on the Friday the price continued to move up but did not return back inside. Now I have shared also my trading idea inside the trading community you can see it here where the Bitcoin against US dollar where I'm expecting to see the price on higher levels than it is currently. The price needs to break above 27700 in order to see further move up to 28800. So I'm currently waiting for the breakout to the upside. So the price has reached higher levels but did not break above 2770 sorry the price has uh, made a breakout above 2770 which is a very important level for very important level on the daily time frame now let's go to the weekly and see how the market looks we can see that this week has closed and it is still active we can see it here it is still bullish so i'm expecting there is probability that the price will continue to move up we can see on the monthly, because the previous month has ended, we can see a very important level on the monthly time frame. It was here. The price could not return back up. The, this week, the price has continued to move up, and we can see the next level where the important is 28291. So, this market over here, how it looks, it looks for now bullish at least for me and a very important level is this one 28372 and the next one is 29269 very important levels to see where the price will go will it bounce it back down or it will make a bullish breakout even more and reaching 29800 and also 2920 very important levels. In order to see much more clear information, we will see weekly time frames, which are suggesting what could happen. And let's see very important levels. We can see on the weekly time frames is this one here, which is uh, the price is coming very close. We have two more days until this week ends. If the price closes above this one, the next one where the price could reach is two. A 29 price level and very important level for the weekly time frame is this one 29385. If the price closes below above this one on the weekly time frame, the price can, could continue even more up and reaching 3000. So it's very important to see how this week will end and we will see on the daily time frame what are very important levels. So the price has made a breakout to the upside, we can sit here and a very important level where the price could stop is 28848 on the daily time frame. If the price goes above and reaches this supply zone, which is a very important level around 30,000 price levels. But on the daily time frame, very important level to be broken is this one 29445. This is the area around around this one. So I'm expecting that the price will continue to move up at least after this bullish breakout. For the entry ideas, I'm also sharing the entry stop loss and take profit inside training community. So if you would like to check, it, please join and see you inside. For the Ethereum, we can see what has happened this week. The prices continue to fall down. The price the previous week has bounced very high from this great supply zone and then continued to fall down for the three days and on the and uh, for the four days and uh, then on the Friday the price has bounced from this one here and then reverses back up. So this breakout to the downside was not valid one because this bullish on the bullish candle on the Friday has cancelled this bre uh, bearish breakout. So currently the price is above and also around this 160, 1640 area which is now acting as a support we'll see how this week ends and also how this two days ends we'll see what will happen now inside the trading community i also have shared my opinion for the ethereum the price is forming a confirmed uh, bullish breakout i'm seeing the price will move up up to 1703 critical level is 1730 where the breakout to the upside should happen in order to see the price on 1800 until that breakout happens i'm waiting outside of the market so the critical level is 1730 17 
1730, which is here, very important level for the price to move up. And also I'm seeing the price will move up, up to 1703, 1703. This was what was expected. But this didn't happen this week because the price has continued to move down. So this is why I have said it is very important to see bullish breakout in order to enter into the market. Until then, I have waited outside of the market. And we see what has happened. The price gone out down, made, made a bearish breakout and it was not confirmed. Now the price is back inside. On the weekly time frame, we can see that the price has formed this um, bullish candle the previous week and this week the price continued to move up and then reverses back down. We have two more days until this week ends. So the, it's very important to see how the market will close this week because there are very critical levels on the weekly time frame that needs to be broken to the upside if we would like to see the price on higher price levels. And also there are very important levels on the downside which are very important for the bears for the bears now let's go to the monthly the previous month has ended like this as a small bullish pin bar and did not close below that now we can see that after this bullish breakout this month has started and moved up but then reverses back down from the strong supply zone we have seen on the daily so what we can expect after this uh, bullish after this bearish candles and then this one a bullish pin bar it's very important to see on the weekly time frame how this looks because very critical level on the monthly time frame is this one we, where we have three more weeks until this month ends and also on the upper side a very important level is this one 1717 so very important levels on the downside is this one where the price currently is and then also this one which is 1516 let's round this number now let's go to the weekly and see what we can expect let's stretch this a little bit up so the price has formed this bullish breakout and then try to reach higher price levels but then return back down this could be also a confirmation of this weekly bullish breakout where the price needs to confirm this breakout as a valid one so we need to see how this week ends because we have two more days if the price stays above this one area here which will be a very important signal for the price it should be about 1615 if it stays above this will be still bullish momentum active and we'll see what look what, what will happen on the daily time frame if the price goes down on the weekly time frame this will mean that this was a false false uh, bullish breakout and there is a probability that the price will continue to fall down up to here 1550 let's go to the daily time frame and see how this looks very important levels has been and what we have seen is this price tried to go down it was a false bearish breakout the price has returned back up so very important level for the price where we need to see daily candle closing above this one here 1655 in order to see the price going up and uh, going up to here 1678 price level if the price goes above this one this will mean that the price will continue to move up and reaching this one 1700 price level if the price goes down again this will be the next bearish breakout to the downside and we will see what happens then so we have two more weeks until this month ends which will be very important but for me as it looks right now the price inside indecision range area where the price is maybe making a bearish breakout then return back up there is not enough strength to move up so it will be a very critical level that needs to be broken to the upside or to the downside on this daily time frame if you would like to see what i what are my entry ideas for the next week you can join my trading community and you will see what is the entry stop loss and take profit idea if there is any that is all from today analysis i hope you enjoyed if you have any question feel free to leave a comment if you like the analysis click the like button and subscribe See you next time and a happy trading.